John 4, the widow of a man shot and killed by his own cousin talks to us about why she is absolutely positive this whole thing was an accident. The scene playing out on Halloween night. Yeah, Pittsburgh's Action News 4 reporter Bob Mayo now with this outpouring of love for the person who pulled the trigger. The issue to be settled in court was a Halloween night homicide, an accident. These relatives and friends say they have no doubt. The widow of the victim tells me. I know it was an accident. I am 150% sure that it was an accident or I wouldn't be here. At the victim's Upper St. Clair home, hours into the night of sharing shots and beers, police say Josh Peremsky said his gun was not loaded when he handed it to his cousin visiting from Missouri, Stephanie Muniza, asking if she could shoot someone endangering her or family. She pointed and fired what he said was an empty gun, fatally hitting him in the head and neck. Family and friends, including the victim's mother and father, brother and sister, joined the widows supporting Muniz's request to be freed on bond. We're all here to, you know, be here for Stephanie. It was an accident completely and totally, and we just wanted to come home and be safe and with the rest of the family so that we can get through this and move on. Muniz's bond hearing was delayed for her defense attorney, David Schrager, to brief her on talks with prosecutors. He describes her emotional state in jail. Devastated. Um, she is inconsolable, racked by guilt and grief. Um, she cries. Um, my heart went out to her. We're just all here to be together for her so that she feels, you know, we're here to support her. The defendant will be back before the judge 11 a.m. tomorrow morning. Downtown Bob Mayo, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.